Hey, what's going on everyone? It's Peter here, the all-natural chef, and it's uh, Saturday night, and I'm going to make some scampi. Shrimp scampi, that is. And I'm going to see how quick we can get it done. So, um, just cooking for one, so I don't have a lot of time, so let's make it happen. What do we got? So we got the water boiling, so let's pop, in, pop the uh, pasta in. So we got some Barilla Protein Plus Pasta. Pull that down in the water. Get that going. All right, here's your hot pan. So let's go ahead and get the scampi going. So we got shrimp scampi going on here. So once we get the pan hot, we'll just go ahead and uh, drop our butter in there. So we're going to go with about three tablespoons of butter. We're going to melt the butter down. All right, as you can see, I did a little prepping. So we're gonna go butter, olive oil, extra virgin, we're sauteing. Let's get and put a, a nice splash of that in there. We got our olive oil going, our butter in there. And as soon as that starts to melt down, we're gonna get and drop our minced garlic. So I went ahead and sliced some fresh garlic up here, sliced it up nice and thin and uh, it's ready to go in. So let's get it in a pan, turn up the heat a little bit. All right, that's not gonna take long to get that garlic browned up. All right, so we'll go ahead and get that nice and hot. It's not gonna take take long to do. Alright, so we got the garlic, olive oil, and butter sauteing. And then we're going to get ahead and uh, get ready to put our shrimp in. Alright, as you can see I just had some large shrimp that are uh, peeled and rinsed. And they're ready to go in. Shake it up. Give the pasta a mix. Yeah. I'm going to add a little twist to this here uh, Italian classic dish, sh shrimp scampi. So I got a little uh, sauteed broccoli going there. So we're going to go with some broccoli and uh, maybe some uh, red tomatoes, cherry tomatoes. All right. So, our uh, garlic is uh, sauteing up nice here. Oh, we're going to go ahead and add the uh, wine in there. Don't forget the wine. And this has to go ahead and uh, reduce, so nice splash of that. There we go. You want to put the, the wine in before you put the shrimp in. And that's important. I think I got enough, maybe a little more. There we go. I don't drink much, but need a little wine to saute up the shrimp. All right. Cheers. Pomegranate juice. All right. So uh, let's get the wine reducing here in the pan and uh, get ready for the shrimp. I got some uh, fresh lemon here ready to go in. Give this another minute or so. All right. Let's check the pasta. Pasta's looking good. We could probably take that out real, real soon. Do the pasta check. Test it out. Just go throw it to the wall. And see if it sticks. Right. Now nah, I'm not going to do that. I'll taste it. Go on. Need another minute or two for the angel hair. There we go. That's reducing real nice. Take out the wooden spoon. The wooden spoon's a classic. Makes everything taste better. All right, this needs to come off a little bit. Heat needs to come down. There we go. All right, let's go ahead and do it. We'll drop our shrimp in, in the pan. 
Shrimp is in. Shrimp is not going to take long. Shrimp's in. Let's go ahead and season it up a little bit. Some fresh cracked pepper. It's a lot of work, but not a lot of pepper. You gotta redesign these things. There we go. All right. Little Himalayan sea salt, pink salt. There we go. Not much of that. And uh, we'll hold off on the red pepper. All right. Keep going. All right. Check the pasta one more time. Smells good. Looks good. We're gonna get and flip these shrimps over one time. Get them nice and pink on the other side. Get ready to pop our uh, other ingredients in here. We've got some cherry tomatoes. Get and pop them in. Cherry tomatoes are in. I probably could have put them in sooner. You live and you learn. All right. Now I know. All right. Here's my fresh uh, broccoli. Let's get and drop the broccoli in. There we go. Look at that. All right. Nice. Not too much. Just enough. Give it some color. There we go. Crank the heat up a little bit. Dante, this goes in the, in the strainer. Pops the strain. Oh, don't forget the lemon. Now, you don't want to overdo it with the lemon. It's pretty strong. Just enough. You can always add more. That's it. Not much. Oh, yeah. There it is, folks. It's coming along. I'm going to add a tad more olive oil because I like a lot of juice. And you know what? Another little slab of butter. Because I can. Crack. You can always add as you go. Just to give it a little extra. Alright, what's missing? Alright, a little red pepper flake. Give it a little, little zip, little zing. I like that. All right. Oh, parsley. Got some fresh parsley. Let's add some of that to the mix. There we go. Now we're talking. All right, you guys. Let's get rid of this. Let's get rid of that. Let's get ready to go here. Let's plate up, plate up some pasta. Here we go. Let's not overdo it. Just enough. Perfect. Alright, here we go. Here's our pasta. Mm. Over here. There it is. Oh yeah, that's smelling good. Let's just go ahead and lay it down here. Look at that. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Drop the tomato. Alright. That's, that's the way it is. That's the way it is. And there it is, huh? How about this? A little Parmigiana. Reggiano. Romano. There it is. Shrimp scampi. Genora style. The all-natural chef. Bon appetito. Ciao.